Our distinguished chief guest, Sri N.R. Nayanamutri, founder Infosys, the director of IIM Ahmedabad, members of the society, and the board of governors, faculty, staff members, press, parents, and my dear students. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 58th annual conver convocation of I am Andabad. I would like to extend my heartiest congratulation to the class 2023 and also to the faculty, the director, and all the stakeholders who have come together to celebrate yet another milestone. I see the bright, enthusiastic face of students here who are waiting to go out and shine in the world and fill us with a lot of optimism for the future. The new world that is shaping us up needs our, your enthusiasm, your energy, and your radiance. As you prepare, to enter the world, there can be no greater inspiration for you than our distinguished chief guest today. It is honor to have with us Padma Shri and Padma Vibhushan, Shri Narayan Murthy, founder of Infosys. As we all know, Mr. Murthy has been called the father of the Indian IT sector by the Time Magazine and CNBC. Under his leadership, Infosys has grown to become one of the biggest IT conglomerate in the world with more than 70,000 employees and over $3 billion in revenue and 500 plus customers in the world. On this occasion, I'd like to begin by thanking our faculty members for shaping yet another generation of leaders who will be stepping out from this great institution. To show someone the path of wisdom and honing the talent until it shines, though it's a task of a great responsibility. The faculty at Ayam Andabad has been the lighthouse leading the students on the path of learning which is interesting, challenging, and a process of discovery. I would like to thank my fellow board members and the director Ahmedabad, both Mr. Errol de Souza and the new director Bharat Bhaskar for their leadership and guidance. It is always the vision and the direction that is crucial for the journey of success. And with all your support, I am a is constantly evolving as a greater institution for the voyage of learning. The, the Indian Institute of Management Ahmedabad continues to be acknowledged as one of the top management institutions nationally and globally. The institute continues to, be, to maintain its equis accreditation and also its membership at AACSB. We believe that the recognition are the endorsement of our excellence in teaching and research, as well as caliber of the faculty and dear students. This international ranking also enhances I am Ahmedabad's brand globally. For the academic year 22-23, saw the campus come back to life after the, we witnessed the complete revival of student led of activities like festival celebration, sports tournament, speaker session, and knowledge events. It was certainly very heartening to have the buzz around campus after the pandemic years. At Ahmedabad, at Ahmedabad we have always strived to open the door of, to a diverse range of talents. This year, we welcome 140 working professionals into PGPX 22-23 batch. From a chef to a filmmaker to a nuclear scientist, they all brought in different skills and imagination to the learning session. The students successfully completed the International Immersion Program in October 22 with the support of our partner ESCP Business School France and ESCAD Business School Spain who conducted sessions under the theme Doing Business 
in European countries. This year, 390 students join the MBA PGP and 47 join MBA FABM program. About 33.5% of PGP, MBA PGP batch comprise of students from diverse background and a remarkable turnaround for us. I am Ahmedabad constantly and closely engages with the industry and this gives us an advantage of undertake, understanding and anticipating the requirement of industry as well as the professionals. To ensure that the student's learning experience is current and relevant, we continue to monitor and revise our curriculum by introducing new courses and electives from time to time. Besides offering our globally acclaimed pedagogy, we offer our students as many as 75 electives and 13 new courses in the PGPX batch. During this year, we included total 19 new electives into curriculum of PGP and FABM. MBA FABM class comprises of students from food, agriculture, and allied background. We saw 32 companies offering 38 roles students who pass out of this course. Placement of our other courses are equally very robust. This year, MBA PGP placement, 188 firms participated, offering around 280 job, uh, job roles, which include PPOs. And the PGPX batch, 96 firms have participated so far in the placement process. With over 200 programs offered each year, your institute, executive program portfolio is perhaps the most expansive management program in India. Each of our program is carefully designed to address the distinct needs of specific executives at various points of their career, helping them to upskill and progress. We offer a broad portfolio of over 75 open enrollment program every year with duration ranging from three days up to one and a half year. This, we, this year we offered 54 open enrollment programs, 147 customized enrollment programs, and 13 blended learning programs. We had totally 7,869 participants across the program from the 1865 unique companies and 152 international participants. On the infrastructure fronts, we inaugurated dorm 36 to 43 in the new campus, which accommodated students of PG, our PGP-1 and PGP-2 batches. All PGP-1 and PG-2 classes and corresponding program offices were also moved to the new campus. We pride ourselves on being the research-focused management institute. In addition to teaching, our faculty are actively engaged in producing cutting-edge research, consulting industry, and contributing to the policy-making initiative based on their research. The institute has vibrant research culture, and our faculty are engaged in several research projects. The research seminar, paper presentation, and speaker sessions are regular feature at our campus. During this year, the faculty member have presented the research paper in 36 national conference and 15 faculty have presented in international conferences and collaborated with faculty from leading B schools of the world. We had three faculty members joining the institute this year. Our research center are also closely engaged with industry and working on several real work projects supporting the industry through consulting, teaching and research. Many of our faculty members are regularly invited to be part of crucial government committees in several years. I am proud to share that their contribution have been appreciated by all. The faculty had undertaken around 36, 37 research funded by various organizations including government organization, international ed research advisory institution, ind independent philanthropic institutions, NGOs, not-for-profit companies, startup incubators, and private organization. The research progress projects varied from research in energy sector, environmental study, healthcare, 
consumer research, organizational leadership, food and nutrition, logistic management, women empowerment, IBC code, renewable energy, education, talent, and so on. During the year 22-23, the institute faculty has undertaken around 60 consultancy projects for the various clients, including government, international organizations, NGOs, public limited companies, and stock exchanges. The endowment fund office has been engaged closely with the alumni and the industry as a part of comprehensive portfolio of fundraising activities. The fundraising activities include donation from individual alumni contribution, batch donation, corporate and CSR funding, and setting up chairs, etc. The board of IMAEF approved the deployment of general corpus through base startup pitch contest for IMA students of rupees 1 crore going to be a winning idea. The first and the highest ever initiative for students announced in campus till date. The fund will also be used to institute a range of scholarships. At IIM Ahmedabad, our aim through various learning approaches is to educate and nurture leadership of institute and entrepreneurial organization and support them in their effort to create high quality talent and value. As student of this institute, there is no doubt of the talent that you possess and the value that you bring to the institution that you will join and set to, or set up. The expectation from you are many. Take this knowledge that you have learned through your academic pursuit and keep building them and sharing them wherever and whenever you get opportunity to present itself. The defining future of any advanced learning experience is the diversity of thoughts and the process of inquiry that stimulates. We hope that you will continue to stay on the path of exploration and keep the instinct alive of questioning, being curious, and finding great joy in discovery thing, discovering things. As an alumni of this prestigious institution, please stay connected with us. Let us know about your accomplishment. Share your expertise and encourage others to follow the footsteps of IMA. The alumni and extra relation office at IIM Ahmedabad has been doing wonderful work by conducting plethora of internal and external events involving uh, alumni across the chapter. From the instituting the scholarship to holding speaker sessions, intercollegiate events, meeting of special group interest groups, our alumni have ex been extremely active in contributing to the institute. This year, we have alumni reunion of 12 batches celebrating the 10th to the 55th year of this, their journey into this institution. Yet another significant event was the speaker session with Honorable External Affairs Minister Sri S. Jai Shankar, which was initiated by our alumni as a part of inter -B school Joint Research Projects Initiative. We do hope to welcome you back here as an alumnus with new ideas and initiative that will enrich I am Ahmedabad. Congratulate once again, class 2023. My best wishes to all of you. Jai Hind.